since I made it to Santa Monica for that initial first meeting moment point at which I had gotten to the Pacific Ocean had made it to the West Coast and I was amazingly organized about how I attacked the whole thing, how I approached it, how I uh, explored it I didn't sit down beforehand and figure it all out, but thinking back on it, I was very deliberate. I was very calculating. I didn't waste a whole lot of effort in exploring the area. After the initial uh, discovery of the whole uh, Santa Monica area, which was great, one thing I really quickly found out about was you, you can't really sleep there, not on the beach. Um, they have these Zambini, Zamb what is the thing on the ice rink? Uh, but anyway, it does it in the sand and it basically like uh, rakes it all up and evens it out, smooths it out. If you're laying out there, it's just going to eat you up. I think maybe even one time or two I uh, may have met one, but I was ran off by police before I met one and uh, discovered you can't sleep literally on the beach at night. Most of those areas you can't, or they are at least patrolled. And that was the first time I saw the whole thing with the uh, helicopter spotlight looking down on people and stuff. I never saw it before, but they're yeah, pretty good. If, if they're above you and they get you in the spotlight, you don't easily get away. They, they pretty much got you. But, but what I'm talking about, the whole uh, exploration thing, Los Angeles Beach front area is miles and miles. It's hundred miles or more maybe, I don't know, up and down the whole coast of the Malibu, Santa Monica, through uh, Long Beach and uh, south, San Clemente, all the beach areas there. It's lots of miles. And um, so I went north on one exploration, I went south on a different exploration and then each time I'd go back downtown to the mission there and feed up and uh, get all full enough to where I felt good to go exploring a little more. And I was trying to think about where did I sleep because uh, like I said you couldn't sleep on the beach at night and uh, I realized, at least it seems to me, a lot of it must have been I was walking at night, sleep a little bit during the day, swim a little bit, and that would kind of refresh me and keep me clean. Excuse me, keep my clothes clean, keep my uh, spirit clean. And then uh, look for food. And that's pretty much all I did for a month or so. And then at night I travel. I mean, that was a lot of it was at night I was traveling. And so when I was exploring north initially, it was just a few beaches, maybe up to Malibu. I don't think I went very far initially north. I went south, like through uh, Venice Beach Boardwalk area. Uh, then below that it's like uh, Manhattan Beach and Redondo and Herm 
Mountain Mesa, I don't know, it's a couple of three or four beaches. Before you get to the little the little part of Los Angeles that pokes out. And that whole little knob is sort of uh, not as much a beach area. The Rolling uh, Hill Estates area. Palace Verdes, Rolling Hill Estates. And um, when you come down to the bottom of that is the uh, Long Beach area and the whole uh, harbor, the Los Angeles Harbor area. And uh, a lot of that's not beaches until you get a little further below the knob. So around the knob, it's just not a lot of beaches. But initially, you go from Santa Monica a little bit south and explore those beaches. And then I went downtown and I came back. And then a little further south, I went around to uh, Long Beach around the uh, 4th of July, in fact. and. Uh, there was a big 4th of July concert there at the Queen Mary, and uh, I think it's the uh, Howard Hughes airplane, Spruce Goose, was somewhere in a hangar near there. I, I never did see it, but Queen Mary and this whole like harbor side area at Long Beach was a scene of a big concert for uh, 4th of July for 1981, would have been when I was there, um, was a concert with, I believe it was Riders of the Purple Sage, Three Dog Night, and the Beach Boys, and uh, had a really great night before the concert party with some people that were there and then during the concert it's really great it's a big big mama people and it's two or three other stories right there uh, there's at least three other stories so I'll just wrap it up there going south from Santa Monica, one of the first trips south.